Imagine a world where cities are underwater, wildfires rage uncontrollably and biodiversity is a thing of the past. Scary, isn't it? This could be the reality if we don't address the issue of climate change. We live in a world where our actions are having a profound impact on the Earth's climate. The burning of fossil fuels for energy, the clearing of forests for agriculture, the continuous pumping of carbon dioxide into the atmosphere, all these human activities are leading to an unprecedented increase in greenhouse gases. And what's the result? The planet is warming, and it's warming fast. Our ice caps are melting at an alarming rate, causing sea levels to rise. Coastal cities are threatened with flooding, and small island nations face the possibility of disappearing altogether. But it's not just about rising sea levels. The increase in global temperature is leading to more extreme weather events. We're seeing more intense hurricanes, more severe droughts, and more devastating wildfires. And let's not forget about the loss of biodiversity. As habitats are destroyed and temperatures rise, many species are being pushed to extinction. Our planet's rich tapestry of life is being unraveled, and once it's gone, it's gone for good. But here's the thing. This isn't some dystopian future we're talking about. It's not a far-off possibility. It's happening right now, right before our eyes. The good news? It's not too late to take action. We still have time to make changes, to reduce our carbon emissions, to protect our forests, and to transition to renewable energy sources. But we need to act now. We need to act decisively. Remember, climate change isn't just a theory. It's happening now, and it's happening fast. The future of our planet, the future of our children and grandchildren, depends on what we do today. Let's make sure we don't let them down. Think about the last time you turned on the tap or flicked on a light switch. Did you ever stop to consider where that water or energy comes from and what happens when it runs out? Every time we take a sip of water, switch on a light or drive our cars, we're tapping into the Earth's finite resources. These resources, which include water, energy and food, are fundamental to our survival and our way of life. But they're not unlimited. As the global population continues to grow, the demand for these resources is skyrocketing. We're straining the planet's limits depleting these resources at an unsustainable rate. This isn't just a future problem. It's a problem for today, and it's a problem for tomorrow. Imagine a world where clean, fresh water is a luxury, not a given. A world where electricity is sporadic because the energy sources we rely on are dwindling. A world where food shortages are commonplace because the soil is too depleted to grow crops. This isn't a dystopian fantasy. It's a potential reality if we don't change our ways. The impact of resource depletion goes beyond just making life more difficult. It can lead to social and economic instability, conflict, and even collapse. As resources become scarcer, competition for them intensifies, potentially leading to conflict and unrest. But it's not all doom and gloom. We have the power to change this narrative. By implementing effective conservation measures, we can slow the rate of depletion. By investing in renewable energy sources, we can reduce our reliance on fossil fuels. By developing sustainable farming practices, we can ensure a stable food supply for generations to come. These are not just possibilities, they're necessities. If we fail to conserve and find alternatives, we risk pushing our planet beyond its limits. We risk exhausting the Earth's resources beyond repair. We only have one Earth. Once its resources are gone, they're gone for good. Ever feel like the world is getting a little crowded? You're not alone. The Earth's population is growing at an unprecedented rate, and it's putting a strain on our planet. Global population numbers are soaring, with projections indicating that we could be sharing the planet with nearly 10 billion fellow humans by the year 2050. That's a lot of people, and all these people need places to live, food to eat, and resources to survive. The knock-on effect? An intense strain on our environment. Let's consider habitat destruction. As we expand our cities and towns, we're encroaching on the natural habitats of countless species. Forests are being cut down, wetlands drained, and grasslands converted into agricultural fields. With their homes disappearing, many species are struggling to survive, leading to a devastating loss of biodiversity. Then there's pollution. With more people comes more waste, and not all of it is disposed of responsibly. Our rivers, oceans, and skies are choking on the refuse of our existence. Plastic waste, air pollution, toxic chemicals, they're all contaminating our planet, posing a threat not only to the environment, but also to human health. And let's not forget about resource depletion. Water, energy, food, these are all finite resources that we're using up at an alarming rate. As the demand increases, the supply dwindles, 
and we're faced with the very real possibility of running out. However, all hope is not lost. Overpopulation is a challenge, but it's a challenge we can meet head on by addressing its root causes. Education, access to family planning, and gender equality, these are all crucial elements in slowing down population growth and promoting sustainability. Our planet's carrying capacity isn't infinite. We must find a balance between growth and sustainability. It's a tightrope walk, for sure, but one we must navigate successfully if we are to ensure a future for the generations to come. The threat of nuclear warfare is like a sword of Damocles hanging over our heads. The consequences of such a war would be unimaginable. This isn't just a line from a dystopian novel. It's the grim reality of our world today. The proliferation of nuclear weapons has created an unprecedented threat to the Earth's survival. A single nuclear warhead detonated in a populated area could result in millions of deaths in an instant. But the immediate devastation is only the beginning. In the aftermath of a nuclear war, the world would face an environmental catastrophe known as nuclear winter. The massive amounts of smoke and dust thrown up into the atmosphere by nuclear explosions would block sunlight, plunging the earth into a deep chill. This sudden drop in temperature could devastate ecosystems, cause widespread crop failure, and potentially lead to global famine. Imagine a world where sunlight is a distant memory, a world where the air is thick with the acrid smell of smoke, a world where the ground is covered in a layer of radioactive ash. This is the world that could be created by a nuclear war. Not only would nuclear war lead to an unprecedented loss of human life, but it would also have a profound impact on the Earth's biodiversity. The radiation emitted during a nuclear explosion can cause genetic mutations in plants and animals, leading to long-term damage to ecosystems and potentially driving many species to extinction. And yet, despite the catastrophic consequences, the threat of nuclear warfare persists. There are currently over 15,000 nuclear warheads in the world, each one a potential sword of Damocles. But there is hope. The key to survival isn't more weapons, but peace and disarmament. By working towards a world free of nuclear weapons, we can remove this sword of Damocles and secure a safer, more sustainable future for our planet. Because the only sure way to survive a nuclear war is to prevent it from happening in the first place. The key to survival isn't more weapons, but peace and disarmament. Space is a vast and unpredictable place. While the odds of a massive asteroid colliding with Earth are slim, the consequences would be catastrophic. This isn't some far-fetched science fiction scenario. It's a cosmic roulette that we're all part of. If a large asteroid were to strike our planet, the impact would unleash unimaginable destruction. Massive tsunamis could wash over continents, wildfires might rage across the globe, and dust clouds could block out the sun for years, causing a nuclear winter. This would drastically alter life as we know it, but it's not all doom and gloom. Scientists across the globe are working tirelessly to detect these potential cosmic threats. Using advanced telescopes and radar technology, they're tracking thousands of near-Earth objects. And not just that, they're also developing strategies to deflect or destroy these asteroids should they pose a significant threat. We can't predict or prevent all cosmic threats, but we can prepare and mitigate. The future of our planet isn't set in stone. We have the power to change the course of history. Every decision we make, every action we take, matters. From the smallest lifestyle changes like recycling or conserving water, to larger collective actions like advocating for cleaner energy sources and sustainable policies. Each of us has a role to play in this grand tapestry of life. It's not just about saving the Earth for future generations, but also about ensuring a quality of life for all species that share this planet with us. Sustainability isn't just a buzzword, it's a way of life. It's about striking a balance, living in harmony with nature, and understanding that we are not separate from the environment, but a part of it. Remember, change begins with you, with us. Together, we can shape a future that is not only sustainable, but thriving. The fate of our planet is in our hands. What will you do to make a difference?